hi guys welcome back to my channel so today we're gonna get into all the pickups I got I know you only see one thing right here so far but trust me when I say there are a lot of things that I bought recently so if you like this video and you like videos like this subscribe down below and make sure to like the video and tell me how you feel as well so let's jump right into it because I actually have a lot of stuff I didn't realize I bought so much stuff until you know when you're all when you're unpacking it and you're getting ready to put it all up you're like oh it's a lot of stuff so <laughs> I decided to make a video just show you guys what I picked up now we're gonna start with a couple things from Joann's I'm pretty sure I got everything mixed up at this point so I'm just gonna go through and tell you what I got from where what's going on and how's it going down all that good stuff so first things first I picked up a couple more um some more paper it was $2.97 in Joann's so the whole wrong wrong um collection in Joann's is currently on sale um actually not on sale on clearance let me read that correctly for $2.97 a lot of their stuff over there is $2.97 the notebooks are more of two um not two but three dollars but yeah everything I'm gonna show you guys everything that I got and I'm just picking up gradually from inside this box I got sitting next to me so I'm sorry I'm not going to give you all at one time. I should have organized it better, but everything's together now. <laughs> so next I went to Michaels because Michaels has better stickers to me. I went to Michaels and got these. They're called thickers because the way they are inside, like they're called thickers. So I went and picked up some of these and I usually use these like on the outside of planners or things like that. So if you follow me on Instagram, which you definitely should be, you'll know that I usually um, put my initials on everything. Well, ever since I got the um, Happy Planner cover, I couldn't I couldn't find anything I really wanted to do. So what I ended up doing was emblem, not embleming, but I did like this. I did my initials right at the bottom of it. It stuck pretty well. I did put um, a little glue on this because I don't plan on. Sorry, my ring is going off. I don't plan on um, not taking this off. I might switch it out for the gold these but I didn't put a lot of glue to the point where I can't I don't feel like I can get these off comfortably while ripping the fabric so that's what I did with these I'm gonna move this out the way but yeah these are really really cute so these have a gold floral design on them if you can see that on the H a gold leafy floral design and then these are just pink and gold which you know this is my color scheme of life I don't know what I'm gonna use these for yet because I can't just use all of these for that for sole purpose. I'm going to figure something out. So next, I'm moving things out of the way, guys. It's so nice to have a microphone now because now you guys can hear me when I'm moving. <laughs> um, I bought this from uh, Hobby Lobby. It was on sales 40% off. It wasn't part of the um, Joann's, of course, because it's the Hobby Lobby edition. The reason I didn't get the one in Joann's is one, because they didn't have a lot left. Ooh, excuse me. They really had the um, half sheet ones in the, um, not the micro, but the mini ones. And I don't use those like that. I use the half sheet for work, but I wanted a full one. Just so I can honestly, oh, this is really pretty. I like that checker. Get the guts out of it. And I wanted um, a certain layout specifically because I have, I wanted this layout. Excuse me because I like um, having extras of this layout because this is my most used one but in all honesty I bought the extension packs for all the other layouts and I also got the guts out of another planner that was like I think I got it for like 10 bucks because it was on sale so I just like collecting the guts because you always can get extra planner guts and do things and just switch out like 2020 you'll get a sticker that switches that out you can um get stickers to move these around things like that so I always get extras of everything and then I also have undated stuff but this I really needed the vertical layout so it's a very cute planner I mean for somebody who's just looking to pick it up it's really cute I haven't even like took, took it apart yet because usually when I just do something for the guts I keep it together for a little while um but it is wrong wrong and they don't really show the details on the back but yeah I'm pretty sure you guys have seen this one it's got the plastic rings and everything you guys have seen this one before because it is been out for a while now so um next pick up from hobby lobby i got some more folders because i needed some um mine were getting kind of torn up so i just got this little set that i saw and i took out this one already but i got this set so i'll open it up and show it to you guys 
So this is just the basic folder set that they sell in stores. It was 40% off everything in Hobby Lobby at this moment in time with Happy Planner items. No restrictions on what items. So this is the first folder. And that's the front and back. And you have this folder. And it says Grace, Love, Big, Smile, Humble, Stay Humble, all that good stuff. So yeah, it says all those cute little things. And then we have this one. This one's really pretty. It's got that gold foiling, rose gold foiling on it. Focus on what matters. I don't really kill for the like the weird leather design, but I really like the gold foiling. So they whoever designed this did a good job because I hate this, but I like this, so I like it all together. It's really interesting. Um then you just have hello in this pretty color. And then you have Dream Every Day with this gold and this um, checkered black pattern and then the polka dot. I give it up to whoever designs these because I can never think to put all this together and make it work. Like, patterns and make it fashion. I don't have that skill. <laughs> so next, I'll grab two things. So next I had more paper. Um, this was at clearance for $3.47 at for the Ron Ron collection in Joanne's. And this one has the um, the paper you see at the top. And then I didn't ever notice it had the top priorities paper in here, which is pink and it's so pretty. So, 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 so pretty. So I'll actually take a page out for you guys to see if I didn't take it all out and put it in my notebook already. Hopefully I didn't. Nope, I did. Okay, here we go. Did I? I love this paper like the top priorities and then it's the color and then it's gold and it's when you flip it over it's all pink dotted oh look at that gorgeous no it's gritted on the back excuse me because the front is dotted and then the back is gritted okay did not know that oh I don't pay attention so yeah that's pretty cool it's pretty cool but I love these I love these for the half sheet because you know what I do for the half sheet planner for my work I actually fold these just like so just so it doesn't cover up the dots I probably could fold it over and just hole punch it but usually when I do this I'm at work and not paying attention I do like this and then I'm able to do this for work in the half sheet so I'm actually going to grab my half sheet planner and oh I think I already got a couple pages already done in here let me see do I let me see I should have a couple pages already folded in here I do okay so here's one. So I'll write my priorities for that. And I'm left-handed, so people who this kind of will bother with are right-handed. But since me being left-handed, this was just so perfect for me to do this. And then I have my notes for what I need to do at work too. So say if I have more tasks I need to do and I don't want to use like a tally sheet for some reason. If I have really important tasks like this is what I need to get done today. This is a non-negotiable. This is what I do. So I'll actually just pop this one right in here. I have a couple of these sheets just ready in here so this is actually my work planner and then my to-do list sits on here during the weekends when I need to get stuff done so next we have I'm gonna move this out the way good lord we have um, some just filler paper from Hobby Lobby it's the sparkly kind and it's the sparkly and then it says make it happen um, this one just has that holographic top to it if you can see it through the paper and I just picked up some extra filler paper because you guys if you haven't said in a thousand other videos I am moving soon so I wanted to and I'm moving out the country so I wanted to make sure I just stocked up on everything like literally just had two big boxes full of just happy planner stuff so I can still create content um and not be limited because I don't know if, um I don't know if these stores and these companies ship to Japan so I just want to make sure I stocked up on a lot of different stuff so next I have more filler paper because who can who, who can beat 297 filler paper? Like you know when you get when you see filler paper, it's so easy just to rack up on it. So filler paper from my half sheet, also my classic, also my big happy classic, because this filler paper is just great for everything. Um it's quick to make little notes. So if I have a little to-do list or anything, I always grab this filler paper because it's just so easy. This filler paper comes with two, it comes with the um, it's the wrong wrong correct collection excuse me and it's got the girls with big Ben, and then it's also got the purple so actually I'll put this right here guess what guys more filler paper 
So this one's kind of conglomerate of everything because I kind of already took this apart and put everything together. So bear with me. This filler paper was the the colorful ones. So let me see if I can find my little notebook. Is my little notebook over here for what I did? I don't think it's over here. Is it in my purse? It must be in my purse. Oh, wait, yes, in my purse. So I bought the mini size for daily affirmations notebook. Um, I actually created one. I originally had one and then I was like, I'm not using this. I don't know why. It's just not speaking to me because it was just a normal, regular notebook. I hate to be that person, but I need everything happy planner. So I ended up um, making, getting one this size. And what I did was um, just bought filler paper for it. So I bought plenty of filler paper with all these different colors. Let me stop flipping this. And then I've also bought the same um, pages for for the half the same one I bought for the half sheet not the half sheet the classic I bought for this one as well and then I also got the little mini I think I just dropped it where'd it go uh oh there it is also got the little mini ones which is 247 that was on clearance at Joann's I bought the little mini ones so what I usually do is um I put the the daily scripture on these and then attach it to the page and then I'll do my daily affirm my daily devotional and daily affirmation that way everything's together but I don't feel like I'm wasting pages in different sections so everything is hey this is today I did devotional I did affirmation boom bam done you can go back and reference everything from that day and then I just bought some extra filler paper for it as well you know what time it is guys more filler paper more filler paper. <laughs> I bought um, the same paper for $2.97 in clearance at Joann's and it's the same purple and Big Ben with the ladies um, one and then I got the focus on paper. Um, this one is straight out focus on paper. I think it's got the it's got the white stars in it as well. I can't really tell but I bought this one just to be able to use the stars as like a guide if I wanted to to do to-do list or however I decided to do that. So yeah this is the last one. So those were all my pickups I got at Joanne's and Hobby Lobby over the weekend. I just bought a whole bunch of restock stuff. Um, I probably should have bought this. I don't know. I don't think they were on sale even cheaper earlier this year. I don't remember. Earlier last year. I don't remember. All I know is I restocked everything. Am I going to still shop? Probably so because there's a couple of sticker books. Oh, I did get three new sticker books. Um, But they're not even with me right now. Oh my gosh, that sucks. Hold on. <laughs> I'm going to find these sticker books. So I also got three new sticker books. I got the Fun Florals one. Guys, if you haven't realized about me, I love florals. I don't know why, but florals has been my thing. So just a quick flip through of this one. So you got the rings, you got these. No, it's just, I love florals. Florals is my jam. Look at the, oh, look at these. And I'm trying not to do all my layouts in floral, but this is kind of like my jam. My bam, my bam, my bam and jam. Like, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Look at this. This was definitely worth every penny. Um, Joann's had them for buy two Happy Planner Arms, get one for free. So I bought two um, sticker books and got one for free. So this one, the goals one, the Boss Bay Goals is new. So I'm going to take a little second to flip through this one because I know for a fact this one is new. So got this you got the little um to-do list the colorful to-do list you got the goal one goal two goal three i really like these because i might use these in my regular um short term long term step one step two step three these are really like different i love these i don't know how i want to use them yet but i love them so maybe i'll get some more mojo you got project this week's action so if you want to do like projects or something on the side gold crush these are really really pretty challenge yourself so what is the goal oh yeah this is definitely keep dreaming keep planning the plan the dream this is really nice i kind of want to set up like some pages where it's just all about my goals kind of like um a vision board which i already have but i want to do it like happy planner style that'd be really cute and fun and then i've been wanting farmhouse just because i like um the floral in farmhouse so i bought farmhouse I also like their their I don't know what to call it but this color this pastel color 
theme. I'm going to zoom in just a little. This pastel color because the lighting has changed. Ooh, this morning there was no sun and now there's all the sun. I don't think I'm going to be able to get the sun off of here. Sorry, guys. There we go. So, and then they got the foil florals. This, this page, I flipped to this page somehow coincidentally first when I first got it. This is what sold me on it. Like, this is beautiful. Um, extra coffee, um, little clocks, what's to dinner, eat out, things like that. To do a priority list, more floral, um, little floral boxes. I don't know how I want to use these. I love these. I wonder if I can put these like on the outside. I don't know. We'll see. I'll figure it out. And then more, more of these some arrows floral as you can see i've already used some of my floral and little chickens and little cows and pigs i've already used some of these floral i did it for a layout in my work planner um i don't know we got more pages huh? more floral little lines um labeler things if you want to to do in notes I like how they included blank ones too that was really really neat and oh this is really pretty Remember top priority and a little couple of those. So yeah, I bought those. Super excited about these. Um, I kind of like I was saying on my Instagram. If you guys don't follow me, go ahead and follow me. <laughs> um, I lost my mojo for planning, um, just like layout planning. And I've been kind of going through a slump. Like I can't really put colors and schemes together like I used to. Um, I'm not saying I was great at it before, but good lord, at least I could put a pink with a blue and find out some way for all of it to coordinate together. You know what I'm saying? So right now I'm going through kind of like a planner slump where I think I'm going to be, um, I don't want to take a break, break from doing weekly plan with me, but I want to take more time, like literally starting on Monday and not, and taking the whole week to think of a theme and put colors together and put schemes together, because then that way it's a lot easier for me to kind of see what matches because there's a lot of things I can use both all three of these books and put something beautiful together but I just can't see it in my head how I want it to come together especially with the boxes um I might end up changing the layout of my planner I know I just bought a vertical layout but I was like maybe if I change the layout it'd be a little bit easier for me because I'm going through a slump so yeah other than that I these are my only pickups and if you enjoyed this video make sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you guys on the next video bye